Hey y'all. Hi. Hola. Everybody, welcome back to my Parlor peeps, welcome to Parlor 5. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you know what's going on in the parlor at all times. And for my returning parlor peeps, what's up y'all? So, I have decided that I wanna do two routines in one video, four products versus 10. Um, and so why am I doing this? So I wanted to show that you can achieve glowy, hydrated, flawless skin no matter the length of your regimen. So I like to do eight to 10 products, that's just me because I like to layer and I know that several products go to different layers of the skin um, and they target different things, different concern areas of mine. Um, but I also know that I don't always wanna do 10 steps every day. Sometimes I just wanna do something quick and easy, four steps out the door, especially when everything turns back to normal. I'm not gonna have as much time to do 10 products, but I still want my skin to be glowy, hydrated, fresh, and I want, I want it to stay nourished, and I want it to stay, you know, even. I want the main concerns to still get targeted. And so that's what it's all about. It is your preference, whatever you choose to do for your skin. And so I'm gonna go ahead and do a nighttime routine, and usually my nighttime routines um, are pretty lengthy. They have about 10 steps in it. And then I'll do another routine for you guys so you can see what it looks like chopped in half. All right? So without further ado, you can go ahead and keep watching for the rest of the video. Ahead and get that headband on. My head is just a little big, but we got it on. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and take those lashes off and break down this makeup. Oil makeup removers are my top favorite. I feel like the oils just do a great job at breaking down foundation, concealer, liquid eyeliner, eyeshadows, getting off stained lipstick, all of that. It just does a really great job at cleaning my skin for my first step. So double cleansing is my go-to. Anytime I wear makeup, I do my makeup remover and then I go back in with my gel base cleanser or my foam cleanser to really pick up dirt, really get rid of impurities, excess oils, excess makeups, things like that. I love, love, love giving my skin just a nice, good cleanse. So we're gonna do that for about a minute or so and really work it in as best as I can. All right, so now I'm gonna use my toner. For this video, I'm using the Watermelon Glow Recipe Toner, which helps to hydrate and minimize the appearance of pores. It's very lightweight, very fresh, and it's just gonna pick up residual dirt and prep my skin for the rest of the steps. All right, so my skin is fresh and clean. Just wanna adjust my headband a little bit. But now it's time for my favorite, favorite, favorite step of the routine. It's time to double mask. Um, so I am using the Kiko Milano um, eye patches and hydrating gel mask and you have to keep these on for about 10 to 15 minutes. Um, the nourishing mask has honey and so I really love honey because sometimes my skin gets really dry especially around the eye area and I know honey is very nourishing and I like that it gives my eye area exactly what it can just help to brighten around the eye as well and so since I don't get a lot of sleep this will be good to give my eyes that extra awakening glow. The hydrating um, mask has glycerin and glycerin is great for adding moisture to the skin and kind of keeping it there and that's what I really love about hydrating products, products that have hyaluronic acid, glycerin, calcium, because it's all about helping your skin add, retain, and hold moisture and that is what my skin always needs. So we're going to leave this on y'all. Mm. 
let me tell you guys, you're supposed to leave this mask on for like 15 to 20 minutes. It just felt like forever. Like I was sitting there forever. All right, so we're taking all the masks off. Y'all see how juicy my skin looks. We're just gonna pat all that in, rub it in a little bit, use the extra mask juice just to create like this nice essence that I like to do, and just prepare for the rest of the steps. Two products you guys are going to see are both for the eye and face. They are my nighttime go-tos. They both target fatigue, one around the eye and the other for the rest of the face. Um, they also have a little anti-aging benefit from Immortel Oil, which is giving you a fine glow, but also helping to smooth out fine lines and wrinkles. And they are my nighttime go-tos. I don't skip a night. We're almost done. I'm adding in the oil because I just want that extra boost of nourishment. And so my Urban Skin RX Hydra Nutrient Radiance Restore Oil is gonna hydrate my skin, but revive it from dullness and also give it that instant glow that I love, even in the nighttime, okay? Okay, so we are sealing everything in with my L'Occitane Precious um moisturizer and that i can use day or night if i want but the consistency of it i love it more for the nighttime. it leaves my skin feeling nourished and it's all about protecting so please make sure you protect your skin with the moisturizer if you made it this far go ahead and give yourself a pat on the back but don't forget the lips just do not forget to moisturize your lips they need protection as well all right do you guys see the glow let me move it closer do you see the glow it's glowing all right, y'all, so it is day two. I'm back, and it kind of worked out that I'm doing this because we got errands to run. So I need a routine that is kind of short, sweet, to the point, but it's still gonna give me, of course, what I love, hydration, glow, and just make my skin look like I did 10 steps. So I'll explain them as we go along, and let's, you know, let me just show y'all what it is. We are back at it again with my Pharmacy Clean Bee Cleanser. Y'all, that cleanser is so clutch. Like, it just gets my skin right morning and night, okay? Recording. <laughs> Hi, guys. You guys can take a moment and subscribe to my channel. The link will be posted right up there. Or maybe it'll be in the description box. I'm not sure. But, you guys can also subscribe to The Loft, where we'll be doing hair tutorials. So, you know, it's like a little sister-sister type of thing. She got you with the skin, I got you with the hair, and then together we all just gonna be great and blossom. Feel me? At the Hear Me Out Loft. Subscribe. I need her to hurry up, though. When I am on the go, the essence is what does it for me. It helps to prep my skin, but it gives my skin an extra layer of hydration because it has hyaluronic acid, it has glycerin, and it has calcium. And so my skin is gonna add, it's gonna hold, it's gonna maintain the moisture that I need. And since I'm not using my toner, I need something that's gonna be my prepping agent to pull other products in. Not a day goes by where I don't have a serum by my side. That's it. That's all I'm going to say. I'm not going to say no more. I use serum morning, night. It's going to be in my routine. Okay, that's it. So just warm it up, put it on, and keep going. And by the way, this is my Goddess Beauty Skincare Serum for brightening, evening, and anti-aging, all right? And it's only right that I use the matching moisturizer. I mean, it literally is only right that I use the same ingredient-based moisturizer to protect my skin and seal the deal for the rest of the day. So we're getting that on and my skin is gonna be fire after. I just wanna say, if you made it this far in the video, you are a real parlor peep, okay? All right guys, so that was my four-step routine. I'm pretty satisfied with it. That's about 
as short as I can condense my routine, to be honest, getting it down is not the easiest because for me, everything's necessary. But when you're on the go and you gotta get out of the house, you just gotta do it. So for my skin, it gets dehydrated in the morning. Um, it can be a little dry, it can lack a little glow. So I like to make sure my routine is gonna give me intense hydration. I like to make sure that at some point it's gonna take care of any premature fine lines and that it's gonna continue to keep my skin even and get rid of dark spots and things like that. Hence why I use the four products that I did. So for me, serum is absolutely important because it really targets the major concerns, which is unevenness, dark spots, and premature fine lines. For me, um, using the essence was absolutely important because I need that extra layer of hydration. Cleansing goes without saying and moisturizing really goes without saying. So those will always be my first and last step in my routine. But again, this is all preference. It's all what you want to do for your routine. You may like the 10 steps, you may like the four steps. It's up to you. As you can see, my 10 steps, I uh, usually do that at night. It's a longer routine, out the door, four steps. My skin though, in the end, glowy. And that was what I wanted. I wanted fresh, hydrated, glowy skin, no matter the length of the routine. And I think we pretty much achieved that, I would say we did. So, if you haven't done it already, make sure you go ahead and subscribe, make sure you hit that notification bell so you know what's going on in the parlor at all times. And go ahead and follow me on Instagram at underscore Marisa dot Nicole underscore. All right, see y'all next time, bye. <laughs>